Greetings one and all, Rafa Tez here bringing you episode 5, the final conclusion of The Descendant. So let's begin where we last left off, where all things must come to an end. Previously on The Descendant. I'm finishing what I started. Donnie! Donnie! Don't you leave me here! Donnie! Donnie! <clears throat> Donnie! Get over here! Two days ago. The Sun of Chamber Arco 1! Whew! Finally actually made it to the actual descendant tank. Oh, back in the past! Hey, look, young Freeman. Maybe. So, you ready to do some work now? Come on, give me a hand with something. Mistakes cost lives. <laughs> Tell that to whoever dropped the bombs. Oh, gotcha. Alright, sad face. It's like really disappointing. Like, who would actually even advertise this? Be like, hey, you know what? With all the janitors that we're going to be working out here, let's make some posters for them looking really sad and depressed and telling them if they screw up, humanity's done for. No pressure. Hey, uh, Don? Yeah? Read out the numbers on the clipboard, would you? Got it. Temperature values for each floor, yeah? Ladies and gentlemen, he can read. What's it say for sub-level one? I can read six. That'll be 50. Okay, and uh, sub-level two? Oh, <laughs> oops. And for sub-level six? Oh, I can't even say 50. 70. And there we have it. Oops. All right, everything looks good here. You better head up top. Connor's freezing his ass off. Why would you? Why would the game even allow you to screw up like that? Well, Freeman already has killed some people. That's not good. You weren't left behind. I'm gonna get you out. This is a redemption story because I just screw up. So Freeman's actually trying to redeem himself, honestly. I'm regulating the cryo tank's oxygen levels. Hey, Don, what's it meant to be? Uh, it's 53. No, wait. It's 54. It's all right, pal. Just take your time. They're just people, same as you or me. Connor, I'm ready for retrieval. Activating retrieval now. Oh. Donnie, come on. I don't know. I'm getting error messages I've never seen. I, I can't make any sense of them. Oxygen. The fault is in the oxygen. Freeman, who's that fucking number? Did you get the numbers wrong on purpose? No, I didn't. I'm sure I told you the right Oops. number. I, mean, I think I did. You think you got it right? Jesus, Don, there's people's lives at stake here. Danny, check again, now. Ah, oh, shit, we're losing her, Donnie. We're losing her. Oh, so we killed someone. Oh, no. Everything's gonna be all right. I'll get it right this time. <laughs> yeah, I told his redemption story. He messed up once because I right. the game really didn't give you a chance to fix it. Let's see what we're working with. Yay, hundred. Damn it! All this, everything we've been through. <sighs> at least some, some of you made it. That's not more me at all. One of the janitors made it. You only got in here three days ago? Okay, gotta get the cryo tank to the surface. What is this? If I'm remembering it right, I need to rotate the levels, and if there's an empty space, then I can move the cryo tanks higher or lower using the machinery. Uh. Okay, there you go. Got it. Oh. Hey. 
You okay? Where's like a whole, whole process mm. doing this? You're Mia Howard, right? Whoa, the hell? Who are you? Take it easy. Uh, I don't know. A <laughs> janitor? I'm a janitor, same as you. Look, I get it. You're alone. You have no idea who I am. All I can do is tell you I'm here to help. My, my name is, is Donald Freeman. Now, I used to be a janitor at another arc. The world up there, it's safe now. I came to get you all out. That's it. Who are you with? Uh, Randolph. I'm not alone. I don't know your history with him, but I, I locked him in a room somewhere else in the yard because I can't trust him. I came here with, uh, Randolph Jefferson. You've got to be kidding me. I know what it's like to think you're never getting out of a place. That you're being forgotten. That someone somewhere has decided your life isn't worth a damn. That's not me. Your life is worth a damn. You are not expendable. And you have not been forgotten. Compelling speech, don't get shot. <laughs> Everything's gonna be alright now. I'm so done with this place. Ah! Oh, me was a shot. No! Oh no, dramatic, dramatic, dramatic. You. Oh, I'm supposed to do something. Grab the gun. Don't even think about it. <laughs> Where is he? Who? <laughs> Where is my son? Oh, your son's here. Answer me. Your son? None of us got to bring family. Look around. Everyone inside this ark, inside this room, is someone's child, someone's sibling, someone's spouse. Every descendant inside Ark 01 is a prisoner, a hostage. Kept here to ensure complete obedience from those of us who were going to be in charge of the new world. You're out of your damn mind. No, he isn't. It's all true. This place was always meant to be the art program's dirty little secret. Classified. No official records. But you never expected they would turn on you and take your son, did you? I only found out when we launched the missiles. What? All I could do was make my boy the equation's top priority. Have it protect him here, watching, listening, learning, making sure nothing happened to him. The other descendants were a secondary concern. The Ark program? They launched the missiles? They... No. You are responsible for killing everyone. Oh my god. Global annihilation. They planned it all. Wipe the slate clean. Start the new world. I uncovered the truth. Threatened to expose the senator here if he didn't get me a spot in an arc. I leaked Arc 01's location to the press before the bombs dropped. In case he thought I was bluffing. I swear, I will do everything in my power to get your damn son. Oh, the Ark got the sun. What did you do? The equation. It's found him. How did you do that? I oh, wish she's just running away. You're not going anywhere. What gave you the right to choose who lived and who died? To decide that you and your son were more important than everyone you left to die. Oh, get him, Freeman. No. Oh, yeah. Do I have to shoot either one? I'm not gonna shoot either one. That's gonna just like make him even more mad. I'm not shooting anyone. It's Fernando. No. No one else dies. 
Not on my watch. He's probably the only person in this world who is completely innocent. Thank you, Donnie. Not for us. Wait, where's the gun Donnie had? Oh, well. That was it. And <laughs> just get hit in the face. That's it. That's the, that, that was the thing. And that's all I know. That's all I did. All I said. Every choice I made. There must be something you messed, Freeman. The equation is everywhere now. It's taking control of every system we have. It's still trying to eliminate threats to the descendants. Why should I care? What? As long as you're in control. You're a threat to the descendants. Where are they? Everyone from Marco One. Forget them. Worry about us. We can't hold the equation back. It's going to destroy everything. Everything we've accomplished. Then maybe you're getting what you deserve. Oh, oh wait, I'm just, Oh, I'm actually controlling it now. Oh god, I, I, I'm not there. This. I have to say, this kind of just like takes the game out of left field. Honestly, it's a bit weird. I made it at least. I'm the only son of a bitch who couldn't live with myself if I didn't do something to try and help those poor people you trapped on the ground. If this is where I'm meant to die, then so be it. You brought this upon us, not me. Ooh. Take him, Freeman. <laughs> you did unspeakable things. <clears throat> and why? Who ordered this? Who stood to gain from any of it? <laughs> How are we supposed to rebuild this world when the foundation is just as broken and corrupt as it was before the world ended? You tried to crush the hope of everyone on the planet and force your will upon everything. Do you hear what I'm saying? Look at me! When will you learn? When will you stop trying to kill everything that stands in your way and just accept that no one is expendable. It speaks. Stop this now! It's a pun. How? How did you do that? My name is Donald Freeman, janitor of Arc Forty Two and Arc O One. I swore to protect the descendants from anything and everything. What are you doing? Release me! <laughs> the equation is everywhere. It can control everything. Every system, every piece of technology, every resource at our disposal. And Don't it power obeys me. So if you want to know how we survive from here, you better start listening to me. Donald Freeman wins a win. He won. That was an interesting conclusion. A lot of plot twists. It's actually fairly shorter than usual. But there you have it. That is actually the end of The Descendant. That is the game. I have to admit, it's quite so proper. I thought the ending would be a lot more bombastic. But in the same token, you know, this game was a twist and turn at every moment. I think that was the good ending. Freeman gets to control the equation or... 
whatever. That doesn't make, actually make much sense. Wait, why are the equation for Freeman? I mean, he had the best intentions in mind, but... I don't know, just okay, it obeys him then. Okay, well, and then Freeman doesn't want anyone to be expendable. And secretly the ARC was trying to kill, uh, secretly the ARC program killed everyone because th they wanted the rule of the, uh, the new world, I suppose. But, maybe if they make a new descendant, you can figure that out later. But regardless, though, uh, I do hope you enjoyed watching the series as much as I've played it, as I always say before. Uh, the next series up in line will probably be another CK2 series, which uh, if you listen to the live stream I did a while back, I did say the next lineup for scheduling, but the next series will be Crusader Kings 2, the Ottoman, Ottoman's uh, gameplay playthrough. So, I will see you around, and this is Red Hotels signing off. Hope. Every, each and every one of you has a good day. And we'll see you around, and goodbye.